There's Burke and Jim. Hey, Burke! Burke! Hey, Burke! Yeah, there's Val. We're bringing it to physics today. Hi. Hi. Hi, Michelle. Hi, Get McGuigan. Study. Act like you're studying. Okay, let's see. Okay. Wave goodbye now. I'd like to take you to the famed percussion lounge. There's the doorway for the percussion lounge. Let's take a look inside and see what we can see. Uh. There's something I hung up a couple years ago. Let's see. There's a big black mark where we wrote all our names. Let's see there. There's one of the signs I've made. I made three of them. Let's see. I can't see our official trash can. There's the old bass drum. Here's all the stuff that we would sit on up there. We'd take that down and lay up there. Let's see, there's the vent. Listen. There's another bench up there. Let's go to the junk drawer. A light switch. That's the percussion junk drawer. Here's a sign. You burn some magnesium on there. Done. We filed everything in these cabinets. Cases, Jim. 
Oh, here's the official percussion lounge can. Let's see. It says percussion lounge down there. I made that. That's about it for the percussion lounge. A lot of good times have happened in here. I don't know if that's so if let it start. Now you can do it at will. All right, Rick. Yeah. yeah. Hi, how are you? I'm fine. Uh, yeah. Hey Russ, lead the way, block everyone. Okay. <laughs> 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 Yo. Hey, Peters. <laughs> hey, Brenda Johnson. Say hi, Brenda Johnson. Come on, Brenda Johnson. <laughs> Oh, Mr. Cusero. Smile, Sue. I got two brothers. Hey, Roy. Yeah. Hey, Tom. Mr. Coomer. Sure. Burke. <laughs> Hey, Jen. <laughs> hey, it's a free-for-all. Hey, free what are you writing there, Jace? It's a free-for-all. This is this is sixth hour before before physics. Hey, stay. Physics. We're going to physics. Let me get my combination here. This is it, Rick. It's mine. Well, it's my dad's, but. Uh oh. Hey, here's fashions over here. Here's fashions. See this picture? <laughs> oh, this is weird doing it in. Woo! David. Oops. This is my This is my over here. There's David and Jason and Rick. Okay, it's a lot. David. Hi. How's it going? Bye. Oh, pretty good. And Riggs! Riggs! I almost hey. called you Dobby! Brennan Johnson! What are you telling me to put it down for, Brennan Johnson? Okay. And Molander. There's Julie. And Molander. Okay, wait, let's get. There's Molander right there. Molander. Hey, this isn't the first time you've been on Pittman TV. I know, you did that to me. PTV. PTV. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Hey, Roaring. PTV, right, man? I'm physics. Hey, Brady. I'll be back here. I'll be back here. Okay, here we go to physics. I got, a little, I, got a little, I got a little treat for you. Okay. It's gonna be a free for all today. There's Sue again. Hey man, don't be doing that. Cindy. Hey, it's Rex. There he is, old two finger. Come on, get going, Dave. Come on, Dave. We can't be late. It's our last day in physics. Hey, Mike, yeah. we'll do that. Yeah, we'll do that. Hey, Mike. 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 Hey, Good day, eh? Hey, yep. Hey, Val. Hey, Val. Hey, Val. Hey, Val. Hey, Val. It's a free-for-all. Hey, hey, today's the last day we're all in here as a class. Yeah. There's Dave already getting in trouble. <laughs> There's... Oh, here comes the rest of the gang. Okay. 
quiz paper. A quiz? Hey, he's going to do that big Hey, Molander's outside. Here comes Molander. And here's where Riggs sits. Molander's outside. Ooh, Molander. Oh, 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 Molander. Oh,
which is roughly 25,000 miles per hour. The satellites that, that went to the moon had to have an escape velocity of a minimum of 25,000 miles per hour to overcome the gravitational attraction of the Earth. Okay? So that's why there's more to the problem than simply a yes or no. Second problem, let's look at the re-entry problem. I mean, I know you don't remember Sputnik, but that's 1958. That's when the first satellite was, uh, was launched. How many people say that if the satellite the speed will decrease? Let's see How many people say it will remain constant? How many people say it will increase? Okay, so the answer to the re entry problem is. because they were told atmospheric friction was slow in the satellite. This is the explanation. At any height above the Earth's surface, there is a critical speed. The critical speed is maximum near the Earth's surface and is progressively less at higher altitude. If the spacecraft is at a given altitude, spacecraft at a given altitude slows to less than a critical speed for that altitude. If the spacecraft at a given altitude slows to less than a critical speed for that altitude, it falls closer to the Earth and gains speed in doing so. But because of increasing atmospheric friction, it doesn't gain enough speed to attain the even greater speed required for orbit, for orbit closer to the Earth. The speed it, it in fact gains while approaching the surface of the Earth is always too little, too late. What they're saying, as the satellite comes closer, to maintain orbit, it has to have a faster speed. So as it falls in, it's gaining speed, but due to the friction of the Earth, it doesn't gain enough speed to stay at that orbit, Not, and it keeps falling. Uh -huh. That's an interesting concept. Then. That's just like how they worried about the astronauts. They're coming, they're trying to come back. Yeah, they bounce off the orbit. Yeah, if they don't hit it right, they, they, oh, they got to back out. That's right, because they're going fast. They're going, they're going you know, they're going to the, they've got to have a little window that they can come in at. Yeah, they're not coming to see the satellite, you know, satellite unguided to the well, a satellite fall back in and they just falls, wind up somewhere where they wouldn't know. falls in and burns up. The thing is, we don't want the orbit, we don't want the spaceship that the astronauts did to burn up. I mean, if we didn't worry about it, the spaceship would do the same thing as the satellite. It would burn up. Didn't they crash into a cornfield or something? Or something? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Alright, how about the last one? Hey, what's this got to do with the and all that? What's the density and structure? doesn't matter how much mass it has. It could, you could have black holes with different masses. You could have a black hole that weighs as much as this pencil. Yeah. It would be about the size of an atom, but you'd have it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Let's go into a little more detail on that. Thanks, Dave. Thanks, That's Dave. Exactly right. Okay, now, if an object is moving fast enough, it can escape from a planet or a star. If it is not moving fast enough, it falls back. The minimum speed required to get away is called is velocity. The larger the mass, the planet or star, the larger the speed of velocity, provided the planet's size does not change. 
Now, a black hole is a thing for which the escape velocity is larger than the speed of light. But the speed of light is not infinite. It is a large number, but it is a finite mass. The mass of the black hole is also finite and not infinite. In fact, the it can be made from very small masses if the mass is actually compressed. Now, if you can figure out how to compress a mass and make a black hole, that would make a good science reference. <laughs> Watch out, you go to you. Please pass the question sheets forward. Ready, Jason? Jason. Yes. Yeah, I'm serious. We're going to have to. Oh, Jason, I lost that one. Come on, get your folder out. Free for all. Free for all. Free for all. Rick, you ready? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Let's go. Get, get the rest of you. Where are you? Oh, it's cold. <laughs> it's a free for all. Free for all. Yeah. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Yeah. Go Val! Go Val! Val! Hey Val! Hey Val! Hey Val! Hey Val! Um, Riggs is this! Riggs! Riggs! Alright, Riggs! Riggs! Why do we get different pictures on this? Dave? Here goes, here goes Riggs, Rick. Come on, Riggs, go! Come on, Riggs! Ooh! Go Riggs! Go Riggs! Riggs! <laughs> oh! <laughs> hey Riggs, get up. Riggs, Riggs, Riggs. Hey Mr. Valentino. Oh, what are you doing taking all those? You can't take all those. Oh, uh, you uh, butter. butter. Just save them forever. Butter. Save them forever. The class of '87 physics. Yeah, yeah, first butter. semester. Butter. Wow. <laughs> 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 the blanks are like. <laughs> yeah, because I. Here, let me see it. Yeah. Yeah. Free for all, eh? Yep, it's free for all. All right, let's go. Hurry up, guys. Let's go. Okay. What What's the first problem? Okay, what problem? Problem number four. Problem number four. A and B or A? A, B, and C. Oh! Correct answer. All right, Mark, come on. Come on up front. Excuse us there, young man. Okay, come on. Funny while it's off. Okay. It's not running yet. Okay, now it is. This is a demonstration. No, we're not getting no. that. <laughs> Riggs, give us some wise sayings. Come on, Dave. Tell us a wise saying. Alright, just give us an old shoot for the camera. Ah, shoot. Yeah. No, I say it like you do, like underneath your breath. Go, ah, shoot. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Remember in sixth grade when I'd zap you on your neck and it'd leave little red marks? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, Rick. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, shoot. I want to hit the two finger drink. Right. Here, ass. Let me look in your ear. Uh, I don't think we need to put it in my ear. Let me get macro. Yeah, right there. There's Jason's ear. Let's get his mouth. <laughs> There's Jason's mouth. I thought it was. Oh, shoot. I thought it was a girl. Let me ask Greg why he's like a seven hour piece of you pig. Oh, bro. God. <laughs> 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 Okay, everybody, pick your nose now. Okay, pick your nose, Dave. Yeah. Dave, pick a winner now. What? No, 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 Dave. You're gonna do that. You gotta go. Yeah. Then I'll, I'll pick your nose. No. <laughs> pick your friends. Yeah, you can pick your friends and you can pick your nose. You can't pick your friends and nose. Look at the. Oh, you, you read <laughs> Look at that zit on his nose. Uh, <laughs> oh, right there. Look at the size of that zit. Holy cow, man. Oh, look at that thing. Please, Dave, don't pop it now. I mean, you might get it all over the lens of the camera. <laughs> Alright. Hmm. <laughs> Wait, did everyone get a No, I mean, you still have a chance, right? You still got a chance. Jamin. Is this Jason. the right answer to the first one? Jason, do you know the answer for B at all? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Do you guys any, oh, any right yet? Oh, no. Oh, no. Alright, I have, I have one for oh, distance vertical oh, equals one half gravity oh, times time. 32T. Alright. Jamin. Give me this. Let's see what Dave's doing. I got it. In case we got. Dun, 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 what do you got dun, 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 dun. All right. Now convert that to meters. That's feet. How many foot in a meter? How many feet in a meter? Three. Three point something. How many feet in a meter? How many feet are in a meter? It's got in, it's got inches to millimeters. No, they were. Ooh, look at that. Hey, let's get a close up of that calculator, Dave. Let's get a close up of Mole Anders' calculator. Yeah. How do you get the first one? He's already at. He's already at the thing. So what is he? He jumps up, right? No, no. Wait. What? Hey, Spitzer. How'd you get that though? I don't know. That's the equation, right? How, how high does he go? I have That's the equation right here, buddy. Equals one half gravity right. times times right. squared. Right. That's it. Right there's the equation. Yep. Is that right? Hey, he's already at, he's Let's already see Molander's calculator. He's already level with the water, so... Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he jumped... The di diving board's probably about a foot above the water anyway. No, but it doesn't say. Oh, then, it, then it could be below the water. Look at that. Hey, Dave. Let's yeah. see Molander's bye calculator, bye. man. That's, that's Let's get a close-up of that there. This is inches. Divided by 39. Wow, can you turn inches into millimeters? Equals. Alright. That's how many First meters. you got to pick them up, 7 point. He goes, how high? He goes 7.96 meters. That's funny. No, no. No way. No way. Okay, here's another problem. Nobody got it right. Hey, whoa, we haven't finished yet. Second chance. Do problem number six. Go, 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 Fire in the hole. Fireball. Fireball. Have you ever seen that gun? It's pretty cool. I'll do it for you. Fire in the hole. Fire in the hole. What are we number six. Let's see number six. 
We're gonna get, we'll get it done. Come on, guys. You guys gotta look and find the equation. We always look that way, Val. Yeah, we always look that way. I have it all set up. I just need it. You think I'm hiding something from you, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I want you to think. Yeah, no, you did a good job of it. Well, oh, no, yeah. no, I can't. I gave you to feel the pockets. I wouldn't want to do that. We'd get it all on tape. Oh, get it all on tape and be sued. <laughs> yeah. You <laughs> sue your, you sue your buns. Shit, my butt's wet. It's nothing. See, you always think we're up to something. Why do you always think we're up to something? Yeah. See? <laughs> We no Why, we're harmless as a kitten. We got one, see? We're harmless as a kitten. Oh, uh, yeah, I got a Gruga, that's not right. Hey, do you know Gil Gonzalez? He's a fair, isn't he? They cheated. Hey, you know Toby Morris? He's no. a fair, isn't he? I see a calculator. <coughs> Columnello yellow. We saw you cheat. Columnello yellow. The flame of the Dante Dave. 48,000. <laughs> 48,000. Oh, that's what we got. Ladies first. 48,000. 48,000. 48,000. 48,000. Should we go visit Hulk at like five? five minutes? What? Should we all go visit Hulk at like five minutes towards the end of the class? Yeah. Hey, Frax. I'm not doing that. Why not? No way, man. Why not? You're in trouble. No, who cares? It's our last day and your last day. Where did you get a go I'm a Let's go visit Hawker. Yeah, you've saved it too late. I'm gonna get a drink, so don't do anything funny while I'm gone, okay? Can I go wet my whistle? What do you have to do? Wet my whistle. Thank you. <laughs> There's Hulk right now. Come on, Bert, come in. Here. Number just... 11. So if triangle A, B, C, is my two. NXT. Then it is also. Go on All <laughs> oh, those wood, that wood is in the way. <laughs> Go back. Go back. Yeah, right about to here. Okay, now wait. Let me look in there now. Oh, there's Prank laughing. Okay, zoom forward. Ready? <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> Wait, you missed it, man. Uh, oh, man, I told you I had to do anything funny while I was gone. I blew the big old pile of confetti. Oh, my God. <laughs> if any yellow submarine, yellow submarine, yellow submarine, and our friends are all aboard, many more of them live next door. And the band begins to play. <laughs> we all live in a yellow submarine, a yellow submarine, a yellow submarine. We all live in a yellow submarine, yellow submarine, yellow submarine.
Okay, but you can throw the ring because everybody's had it now. Ah, I want to see some more fun. <laughs> Say bye. Bye, Rick. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, God, it's cold! Thank you, Reeves. Did he sit on it? Howdy, Jerry.
Yeah. Hi, Ross. Go away. Shit. Where? I'll get it for you. Here you go. <laughs> Here you go, Where are you at? I thought you were getting right now. Where are you at? Come on back to my line. Say, say something, Kim. No, I don't. Yeah, say something. Hey, Bray. Who cares? Who cares? What? Bricks. Yeah. Hey, Christy. Hi. Hey. Christy, give us up. Yeah! Right on. Cool. 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 Yeah, now go, yeah! Yeah! When, get, when do I get to see this? Yeah. Okay. I don't know. Give me some. Yeah. Who? Oh, hey Wells. I already have him on here. That's a big deal. Did you video Hey Rick. Hey. Okay. Do you feel like? Do you, do you feel like David Letterman? Yes, I feel just like David Letterman. Are you ever going to wear that sweater again? Yes. Oh. Is that a sound? Let's, let's see it. There's Kevin Scroggins. Get him on video camera. Big deal. Here it is. Ooh. Get him on camera. No. Yeah. Don't, I don't want to be close up with my face. I can get a close up from 20 feet away. I love your away. shirt very much, Aaron. Here, wait. I like your shirt. Stand right there. Let me get a real close up of your face. You were the one walking. You walked in my class. Yeah. You didn't come by my class. I couldn't get out. I tried and tried, but I couldn't get out. I have it on tape. Me trying to get out. My best buddy. Turn around. What happened to Frere? Excuse me. Yeah. Hey, Prack, I saw you in Hawk's room. Yeah, I know. You guys saw the great Prack in Hawk's room. I'll be first. Hey, Rick. Fire. Hey. Yeah. Hey, it's the Kieran dude. Ah, oh, there's the Kieran dude. Hey, do I have to sign video? Should we get the interview on video? Oh, God. Is it, it's Riggs! Is it yeah, it's taping. It's <laughs> taping. Hey, big ass. <laughs> we have to get interviewed. Okay, I'm gonna cut it off now. Bye. Say bye. Ah!